Hello and welcome to Wet Pool Basics with A1 Rubber. The job you're about to watch will join two concrete areas with a wet pool rubber surface, demonstrating how to wet pour and how easy it is. Preparing wet pour is simple. You'll need rubber crumb, a rubber mixer and a wheelbarrow. CSBR rubber crumb is available in a range of colours from A1 Rubber. A1 Rubber also manufacture rotatub wet pour mixers, specially for commercial wet pour applications. Just add glue, mix and empty. Rubber wet pour applies easily over any surface with appropriate site preparation. To wet pour, you'll need gloves, a trowel and trowel lubricant. If you're wondering what to use as trowel lubricant, A1 Rubber has a product called Polysolve that works just great. As long as your trowel is properly lubricated, the rubber wet pour will spread easily over the surface you're covering, without sticking to your trowel. Simply pour the rubber wet pour mixture over the area you wish to cover and trowel out as you would cement or other mortars. For large flat areas, screed levelling bars should be used. Rubber wet pour is easily moulded into the shape you require and will hold its form without the need for extra support while setting. The mixture will set quickly and is trafficable the next day. Rubber wet pour offers a range of features and benefits as a unique surfacing product. It's extremely versatile, able to be used in almost any application both indoors and outdoors, offering excellent non-slip and impact absorbing properties. Once you've spread the wet pour mixture over the area you wish to cover, simply compact it by tamping your trowel for a firm result. Once that's done, you're ready to refine your wet pour surface. To refine your surface, you'll need a finishing trowel and trowel lubricant. Refining your surface is simply done by smoothing out your tamped troweling marks with a metal finishing trowel. Rubber wet pour is suitable for a variety of applications including pathways, playgrounds, pool surrounds and any other area that requires an attractive non-slip surface. You can also cut away the loose edges to give them a neat, tidy finish. Thank you for watching Wet Pour Basics. For more information regarding wet pour, rubber crumb, rubber mixes or anything else you've seen in this video, please visit our website at www.a1rubber.com.